the next Putting all the so-called guests in check With all of my soldiers on deck I'll be on the front line like I'm John DeFarge Bright sparks that I'm gonna start Taking charge and I'm leaving a mark They're bumping this shit up in Mars Taking it far, speaking from planet Earth She's being hurt and I'm fighting for her Light warrior will not desert I'll be out here putting it worse Speaking the truth, reaching the youth Speaking to them and I'm speaking to you Whole lot of work that we all need to do Time that we all come through and make moves No more days to do with nothing No more watching from the side There's a war between good and evil it's time that you decide When they got you in that crowd Do you bow or do you rise? Are you one of those who resists or who complies? No more time here for denial No more swallowing their lies No more fueling this monstrosity That preys on our demise It's time we take this outside And open up our eyes Identify the strings and cut the ties hey, yo, for real though You think I wanna be in the streets With a mask on getting called a freak Think I wanna walk around wide awake While I watch the world fall asleep Think I wanna risk my life every day Cause the things that I say And I walk in a way that some claim Ain't really safe But I still do what I gotta do I'm brave, I ain't afraid Think it's a game, think it's a joke And that's okay, motherfucker I don't. I look in the eyes of these children and cry Feel what they feel, I know the demise I know that the time is limited Why are we into this? Because we're missing it We look with our eyes But our minds are visionless Look at the fashion, look at the classroom The rap and the culture Now look at the facts, look at the maggots Look at the vultures I step forward to show you that we all must care I chose to live my life like this Because there's no more days to do with nothing, no more watching from the side There's a war between good and evil It's time that you decide When they got you in that crowd Do you bow or do you rise? Are you one of those who resists or who complies? No more time here for denial No more swallowing their lies No more fueling this monstrosity That preys on our demise It's time we take this outside And open up our eyes Identify the strings and cut the ties Folks, when you need a glossary for a federal budget, look, it's got its own fucking glossary. Which means they're obviously making up words. It's their favorite thing to do is make shit up on the fly. Wow. And nobody bothers to ask Obama the simplest fucking question when he says raising the debt ceiling doesn't raise the debt. Nobody bothers to ask, hey, Barry, where's this money coming from anyways? I'm sure the American people don't want to give you a fucking dime, Barry. Where's the money coming from, Barry? Hello? There's different kinds of spending, folks. Look. Actual spending. Actual spending is spending reported by the president after the end of the fiscal year. Actual spending is different from requested spending because it reflects the spending priorities approved by Congress during the annual appropriations process. So here we go with the big fucking words. This is how they fucking flip shit on you. That's why they get great speakers like Barack Obama. Then there is the appropriated amount. Uh, refers to the budget authority granted by Congress. And then it says, see also requested amount. So that's really what it is. It's saying, hey, listen, we need $500 million. And Congress pretty much says, well, they either give him his request or they say, well, this is what we think would be appropriate. Fucking loan sharks, right on the Congress floor. Uh, Folks, when you go, you can actually go to the fucking floor and see these people vote. You'll see them vote three, four times. All of them. I showed you the video a few times. It's unreal. Oh, gosh.
<sighs> then there's appropriation. Now see, they don't go backwards. No, they start up here. You're supposed to start down here. Appropriation is a law that authorizes the expenditure of funds for a given purpose. For a given purpose. So there's a plan for it. A bill that specifies how much money can be spent on a given federal program. Reviewed by appropriations subcommittees in both the House and Senate, appropriations bills must also be approved by the full House and full Senate before being signed by the President to become law. I guess that's why they signed it in when a bunch of the fucking Republicans were on vacation. Which is what they do with all the bills. Which is why whenever something big happens, I tell you folks, keep your fucking eyes on the White House. You're gonna be passing something through. That's why whenever fucking a, a shooting happens, major attack, I'm not even on that channel. I'm up every fucking orifice of the White House and Pentagon seeing what the fuck they're doing. I'm on C-SPAN. I'm on C-SPAN 1. I'm on C-SPAN 2. I'm on C-SPAN 3. Every fucking government channel. I'm watching. Well, you folks are just standing there with your fucking jaw open looking at the TV like it's the fucking first time you've ever seen anything like it in your life. Now look what it says here. Okay, about the House and the Senate. Okay, now, appropriations committees in both the House and Senate are responsible for determining the precise levels of budget authority for all discretionary programs. Right above it. Appropriations bills must also be approved by full House, full Senate. Unreal. And look at, look who's in the fucking subcommittees. Agriculture, rural development, defense, which where most of the black money goes. Energy and water. Military construction and veterans affairs. Folks, they said California has the worst. I gotta show you this. I gotta show you this. I, I really wanted to go through this budget. But I mean, we're only on the fucking C's. Be here all fucking day. It was all the way to Z. That is money owed. That ceiling. The debt ceiling is the limit on the amount of debt the federal government allows itself to hold. Congress has the authority to raise the debt ceiling. Not you, you fucking turd. Barry. How much fucking treason does this man have to commit? Oh, don't worry. He's got a big whopper coming. Because before he leaves office, there's going to be a major fucking attack in this country, you mark my words. Thought I put it up. Um, ah, oh, where did I see that? I'll come across it sometime. Former FBI counterterrorism agent 
Masjid Fresno Islamic Center owned by Muslim Brotherhood. The fucking CIA and the FBI, I'm sick and damn tired of them coming out and saying a threat by ISIS is imminent. There's nothing we can do to stop it. They know where the fucking terror camps are in this country, folks. I'll go and look up the fucking map myself. Watch this. Terror map. U.S. Take your pick, folks. Take your fucking pick. Which one would you like, FBI? Would you like your own? Let's look for the FBI's one. I already know that where the, the, the original one is on National Counterterrorism Center's website. The map of Islamic terror groups in the United States is on the National Counterterrorism Center's website. Hello? Any fucking buddy alive out there? Maybe we could get some, I don't know, Green Beret? Some, some militia? To take care of this? The FBI, the CIA, the president, they know damn well where it is. You ever notice all this shit goes on around certain parts of the country? But they only could, they only talk about certain crimes. There could be somebody shot who just shot 10 people. Somebody else across town could have shot one person. He'll be covering the one person one. Why? Because that's their fucking provocateur. That's their lamb. That's their setup. That's their fucking MK Ultra project. Look at all the fucking maps. Folks, go to National Counter Terrorism Center dot com website. I got it, I got it written down right here. NCTC.gov. What I think people need to do is call the FBI and the CIA and anyone else in government and get in their fucking ass about this shit. Threaten their fucking lives because that's what's on the line. And so is yours. So is your family's. That's it for now. God bless and carry on. Watch your game.